Hey guys, this is a short list of 10 glitches that I think everyone should know about. Let's get into it. Number 1. The critical shot SAS skill only stacks critical damage with base damage. So if you upgrade deadly on your gun, your critical hits won't be doing more damage. So if you have deadly on your gun upgraded all the way, your crits could actually start doing less damage. So don't use your skill points on critical shot. Number 2. The biosynthesis weapon argument will heal more if you shoot more than one bullet at once. Let's say you shoot one bullet at once and kill a zombie. At level 1 biosynthesis, you'll get 3 health. But if your gun shoots 10 bullets at once and you kill a zombie while hitting all 10 bullets, you'll get 30 health. So guns like the Hardthorn, Shockfield, or Mustang can be really good weapons to put bio on. Number 3. Any damage obtained from the target assist helmet argument will only stack with base damage, so the Titan IRN HUD helmet is not that good. Instead, you should use a Dragonfly helmet due to the extra speed. Number 4. In the power out game mode, the first section of zombie spawns, the higher level your team is, the longer it takes for all zombies to spawn. There is only about one zombie every second, so if you have a level 20 team, it won't take long. But if you have like a level 400 team, it can take up to like 5 minutes to get past the first section, which is very annoying. Number 5. The zero casualties achievement is bugged and you cannot obtain it, so don't waste your time going for it. Number 6. The concussion heavy skill will drastically reduce the damage of guns that do damage over time, so don't get it if you want to use a stripper, flamethrower, Krakatoa, or a weapon like that. Number 7. Bosses on your screen can appear in different places on someone else's screen, so if you see that they're shooting next to the boss and not hitting it, that's why. But don't worry, they are still doing damage. Number 8. A lot of the times with Devastators or Necrosis, towards the end of the fight, your teammate's damage stops getting counted for, so you and your teammates will kill the boss at different times. It's really annoying once you start getting Savage Devastators and I don't know how to fix it. Number 9. The Assault skill Adrenaline gives you more than twice the fire rate than it should, so if you are an Assault class, I recommend spending 25 points on Adrenaline. Finally, number 10. On the Steam version of SAS 4, the Assault skill, Assault Team, can be activated even if you don't have a skill point towards it. Although the Assault Team itself wouldn't appear or do damage, pressing 3 will drain energy, tell you that you've used your Assault Team, but nothing else will happen. And that's about it guys, so good luck, see ya!